Hey guys, it's Christina Marie, and today, as well as my dog, are going to talk about five positive changes that Holland America Cruise Lines has made over the past three or so years. So I have another video, which I'll link to below, on um, bad changes that Holland America Cruise Line has made, but they've actually made some really good improvements over the years that you will definitely appreciate as a cruise traveler. Okay, so the first thing is that the muster drill is so much better on Holland America cruise ships now. So back in the day, you used to have to go to the promenade deck, um, stand like really close together like little sardines, was usually kind of hot and you had to wait until everybody scanned their key card and then they did the muster drill. Now, um, my dog's a distraction. Nowadays, um, you can just watch the muster drill on the TV in your stateroom and then go check in, have them scan your key inside the cruise ship on like deck two. So it's way, way better. So that's improvement number one. The second change that Holland America has made is on their embarkation and disembarkation process. So now it is, um, pretty smooth in that you just show your face in front of like a, a camera and it recognizes your face and that's how you check in. Same thing with getting off of the ship. It's super fast. Last time I cruised with my mom, we didn't even have to show anybody our passports. We literally just stood in front of the camera, showed our face and we're off the ship like that. Um, I'll include a link below with my disembarkation process video in case you want to get more information about how that works on Holland America cruise ships. Okay, the third thing that Holland America has improved or changed over the past couple of years is their ships. And this is probably the biggest change. So the newer Pinnacle class ships, which are the Konigsdam, the Rotterdam, and the new Stottendam are really, really nice ships. They're well designed. They're more modern than the older ships. And if you're on an older ship, don't worry. They're still really, really nice. But the new ships are really, really lovely. Um, some of the things that I personally love is one, the newer ships have a Grand Dutch Cafe, um, which has free food. You can pay for coffee and they have this big like chocolate baguette dessert, which is fun to split. Um, they have a gelato bar, which you can pay for, but it's not that much money. The New York Pizza Station is much, much improved on the newer ships. It's now by the pool in the, um, by the main pool. And they now have sandwiches and some more options than they used to have. They have the Rolling Stone Rock Room, which is huge in my opinion. So at night on the newer ships, you don't just have the dueling piano bar and the BB King band. You also have the rock and roll band, which is really, really good. There are big, um, movies by the pool at night, which is great. And then the Rotterdam ship brought back the library, which is nice. So the newer Holland America cruise ships are awesome. They get two thumbs up by me. And that was a great change that Holland America has made over the past few years. Okay. The fourth change is um, kind of minor, but I think from my, what I've observed, the newer ships um, they have more movies in the staterooms now. So if you really like watching TV when you're on vacation and just relaxing, Holland America now has more movies available to watch for free in your stateroom. At least that's the case on the newer ships. And then the fifth change that Holland America has made for the better is their daily guide. So it used to be kind of overwhelming for me to figure out in the daily guide, like what's a promotion, like the the shopping show or a spa webinar talk where they're trying to sell you a service and what's actually like a Holland America activity. Now in the daily guide, it's really clear what's a promotional thing to do and what's an actual Holland America thing. So um, that's it. Five changes that Holland America has made for the better. The first one is a way better mustard drill. Second change is a smoother disembarkation and embarkation process. 
Third change is way better ships if you're on one of the newer ships. Four is tons of free movies in the room. And five is the daily guide. Um, one change might be that they're on their app is maybe better, but it's still not the best in my opinion um, with the daily guide. So that didn't make the top five list. Um, if you thought this video was helpful, please subscribe below. I really appreciate it and it makes my day. And I would love to hear from you in the comments what changes you have observed Holland America making recently. There's probably a lot more changes that I just haven't noticed. These were just my top five Holland America changes that I have observed. Thanks guys.